using AWS. I don't need to worry about my servers anymore. I don't need to worry about my processes crashing. My business processes, they just work. My name is uh, Marco Merens. I am chief of the Integrated Aviation Analysis section in the uh, International Civil Aviation Organization in, in Montreal. The uh, International Civil Aviation Organization, or ICAO, it's an international organization of the UN, and we are basically responsible for writing standards and recommended practices for the whole aviation community. ICAO has started looking into cloud solutions a, a few years ago when, uh, when we were getting more engaged in predictive analysis or trying to find where will be the, the future needs uh, in aviation globally and try to see where would it be best for us to invest uh, our resources. We have users of that kind of information all around the world using any kind of device and uh, it became more important that the data which is um, and the information provided to them is reliable can get there fast and is available at, at any time. The EC2 solution from, uh, from AWS uh, must say came in very handy because we were able to, to create, to launch test servers and production servers for any kind of usage, uh, create them for a period of a few months to do a workshop and then delete them again. We were able to experiment a certain number of, of techniques which we would never been able to, uh, to experiment on in-house uh, in -house infrastructure. The first things we, uh, we actually migrated was our analysis processes. We tried to do uh, only web-based applications. So the first thing we did was we put a few of those algorithms back onto the, the server side. From then on, we actually created new things directly on the cloud. So we, we stopped developing uh, in-house. We actually developed directly, uh, directly in the cloud and also deploying code directly in the cloud. We use uh, S3, of course, which is the, really the, the ideal place uh, for us to, um, to store data either permanently or, or temporarily. The general public can actually buy um, location indicators, which are codes of airports. That's a data set we are selling. So if someone buys that data set, we are actually uh, providing a link to an, a bucket and an data on S3, so we are actually delivering our sales through this, uh, through S3. From my point of view, is that uh, I don't need to worry about my servers, my processes, and everything just works.